Welcome back to the farmhouse. If this is your first time here, my name is Rachel and I'm really glad that you're joining today. I'm gonna show you how to do the red food dye test on your Berkey filter to make sure that the filters are still working properly. Also, Berkey recommends to do the red food dye test when you set your Berkey up with new filters, you know, to make sure that you got them installed properly, there wasn't any damage in transit, that kind of stuff. So I'm going to do the red food dye test and we're hoping that the water's gonna come out clear. If not, it means that my filters are damaged, which would be no bueno. So you want one teaspoon of artificial red food coloring per gallon of water. It has to be the artificial food coloring. So I'm gonna do a half a teaspoon. I have a half gallon of water right here. Let me get it and put it on this side. I'm gonna do a half a teaspoon for my half gallon. Okay, pour it in there and mix it up. All right, and then you're gonna want two either jars or glasses the same size, something to put under your Berkey so that you can do them separately and be able to tell if one's working and one's not. If one is letting a little bit pass through, which means you need to change it and the other one is clear, or the other one's letting a lot through. So you wanna do it in two. It's a lot better to do it in two from the get-go and um, you'll be able to see exactly what's going on then. So I've got my two jars. I'm gonna put them here. Slot this back a little bit and you just find where your filters are sticking out and set it over top making sure that it is over the holes where it needs to be okay and that it's not going to tip and fall off all right so both of them are under there i'm going to pour in my dye real quick and we'll see how it comes out I did want to also say here, it would be a really good idea to test your filters like if you move or something to make sure that they weren't damaged in transit. And as you can see, the water is coming out perfectly clear through both of my filters, which means that they are working properly and filtering out all of the nasty junk that could be in your water. So that's good. I hope this video was helpful for you in setting up your Berkey and che checking to make sure your filters are working good and showed you just how quick and easy it is. It doesn't take a lot of time and requires no special equipment except for your red dye. And thank you for joining today. Vice, um, you know, which would be a not.